In an exclusive interview with Steve Frosty Weintraub at Collider.com, producer Roy Lee revealed that Stephen King adaptation of It will begin filming this year. He also revealed that the Carrie Fukunaga and Chase Palmer script was in fact written by Gary Doberman with help from new director Andy Musetti. Lee also said that the movie is very close to the source material and that the adaptation will be cut into two movies, the first being from the point of view from the kids and the second movie from the point of view of the adults. He also confirmed that both movies will be rated R. Schnepp, do you buy or sell this adaptation of It filming this year as the producer suggests? I buy it the same time I bought it last year when uh, Kerry Fukunaga <laughs> said exactly the same thing when he was like, I'm writing this as two movies. One's going to be this. It's R-rated. One's going to be about the kids. The second one's going to be about the... So I don't really... I, I'm just glad that they're still making it and I'm looking forward to this adaptation. I loved It. I loved Tim Curry as the creepy Pennywise. Yep. That clown is forever going to give kids nightmares. Um, I hope that... I'm, I'm hoping that they're able to do something new, brand new with a clown. I mean, I can't really imagine what else they can do with a human skin mask of a clown. What are they going to do? Is it going to be a clown with an octopus body? What is it going to be? <laughs> you know? So I guess we'll have to wait and see. Um, I don't, I, I, I'm going to say no. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm going to probably, probably won't go that most. far. Yeah. Um, I'm going to sell this. Uh, not because I don't like the idea of it happening this year. There just seems... This is there's been a lot of turmoil surrounding this project mm -hmm. already, so I don't think it's going to happen. At least go in front of the cameras this year. I do believe it's going to happen though. This is just too rich of a story. I yeah. mean, that original series was so good with Tim in it. This will make a great motion picture experience. The two parts are going to be so unique from each other as well. That sets them up in, in such a way that we haven't really seen done in a lot of other films before. So I think it's going to be great. But I sell the idea that they're actually going to get this in front of the camera this year. I think that they're going to. I'm going to buy it because if the question is, are they going to start production by the end of 2016? I think yeah, that's definitely happening. You're not going to see the movie in 2016. It's going well, to be no. like a yeah. Strangers 2 situation where yeah, <laughs> it's going to be produced at some point starting this year. We just don't know when that's going to be because from the producer's mouth it sounds like they just didn't vibe with Kerry Fukunaga for whatever reason because when we read the report of that director departing the project it seemed like because he wanted to make it two parts and because he wanted to make it rated R and the studio was like no and now it's going to be in two parts and it's going to be rated R. Right. Don't understand what the discrepancy was but whatever it is maybe they have the director they want to work with in place now so it gives me a little bit of hope that we can get this thing rolling I heard soon. that Ray, that uh, Kerry Fukunaga wanted to use Ray Winstone uh, for, for Pennywise. I think that I think that turned the producers <laughs> off a lot. Anyway, John, do you think they're going to get this movie in front of the cameras this year? Uh, I have no idea. I have no <laughs> idea. Um, if, if it's part octopus, maybe not. It might take... Uh, <laughs> Might take a little bit longer. Can't believe you went against me, Hill Coach. Oh, <laughs> oh no, that's rough. No. rough. You know but by do? the way, it might take an extra year, but it might be better. With the octopus. Yeah. You know what they're going to do? They're going to go back to the original storyboards of the Watchmen ending that they changed <laughs> out right. and take yeah. that creature and That'd put him in. That would be amazing. It might be worth the wait. Just that combine it with great. Brian Singer's 20,000 Leagues Under the Sea. The clown <laughs> is the squid is the octopus. That's right. Done. Go picture. Right. Please and bring in a Neo. There is no octopus. You know. <laughs> hey, guys. If you like this clip, click here to watch the entire episode. Also, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel because it'll help you stay up to date with all the stuff we've got going on here at Collider.